Hey guys, in this video, I'll be showing you how to get Android O look and feel on your Samsung Galaxy S8 and the S8 Plus. The Android O beta is available for the Google Pixel and the Pixel XL. I know a lot of people would love to try out this clean UI on the Galaxy S8 and the S8 Plus. Or you might be someone who don't like Touches UI, so yeah, this is something that you will love a lot. So this is all thanks to the Pixel Launcher. You can also see that I've tweaked up the navigation bar on the S8 and the S8 Plus. All the download links will be in the description box. So this particular thing, the navigation bar change is only for the S8 and the S8 Plus. So don't try it out on any other Android phone. So, so you can see this looks very similar to the stock Android and swiping anywhere on the display, you can access uh, the app drawer. So it looks really, really good. Like I said, it is a Android Oh, look and feel for your Galaxy S8. We can get the same app shortcut experience as well, but of course, it's the actual Android O running here on the Pixel, so you get a bit more stuff. But here, uh, you can go into app information or check out widgets for that particular application, you know, selecting here and dropping on the home screen and uh, same thing here if I click here go into widgets I get these and I can have it on my home screen holding down the screen you can see that we got three options for settings uh, widgets and wallpapers so uh, it has a lot of lot of great wallpapers uh, I have to say uh, the current wallpaper that I'm using it's called as third point it's coming straight from the Google wallpaper application so you do have to install it separately from the Play Store uh, so that is also very similar here look of the folders are very similar but of course with Android O uh, like the actual Android O you do get this new um, notification dots different colors according to the applications you can see I have red with Instagram blue with uh, Twitter so holding on to the app will show you the uh, notification for that so obviously you don't get that with this launcher just app information like I showed you before I also have the widget area where you can access all the widgets on your phone and then of course we have the settings so of course a bit more options here uh, but with this launcher we only get these so the, we have the app suggestion we have the disable Google app so we do get Google uh, now on widget here by default and then the calendar stuff on the right so if I click here I can instantly search anything I want another difference of course is that uh, you also have the full now on cards here uh, but you can't access that on the Galaxy S8 because uh, Bixby we have the Bixby there we also have home screen uh, rotation so it looks really cool this way uh, with this beautiful infinity display going into the app drawer uh, you can see we have the search tab where you can search any application and then we have the applications on the phone in alphabetical order so uh, which looks also very, very similar to the pixel exactly like that so just like the normal navbar keys you can also customize these keys as well by going into the settings then display the navigation bar and here we have a lot of options uh, different colors or you can have your own custom color and this also works with the theme so i was using the black um, black midnight black team and it was working great with it so uh, that's really really good and again to uh, further get the Android O experience you can have the Gboard uh, or Google's official keyboard from the Play Store you can get that and you can change its uh, look in the settings uh, to black and it looks really really good and give you that stock kind of look I really like this uh, keyboard. I use this also on my iPhone. So, so if you are tired of TouchWiz UI and you absolutely love stock Android, then give this launcher a try. It looks really, really good on the Samsung Galaxy S8 and the S8 Plus. Or you can try it on any other phone that has Android Marshmallow uh, or Android Nougat. It supports that. But this navbar key thing, it's only specific for the S8 and the S8 Plus. So, uh, yeah, this is the closest you can get uh, to have that Android O look and feel on your Samsung galaxy s8 and the s8 plus the beast and uh uh yeah thank you so much for watching this video i'll see you guys in the next one peace out